Hello, everyone. Mr. Stearns here. Wow. Oh, I'm going to do a really quick one here, guys. I just want to give you a quick overview of the expectations, not the specific stuff, but what in general we're going to be doing for lesson 24 for those people getting ready to jumpstart. Okay. Obviously, we're going to read the, uh, the lesson in the book, do it the way we talk about. Always look at the pictures, double check all of your um, work there. Okay. Always check your um, vocabulary, make sure you know all about that, and then go down below and do your ISN work, either here or in your ISN workbook, okay? There's also a link on PowerSchool to the PDFs, if you prefer to do it that way and connect with Cami. Does that make sense? Okay, so we're going to read the lesson, do the ISN pages, and what are the ISN pages? Well, it looks like for lesson 24, did I mark that? It looks like we have page 173, 174, 175, 176, 177, and then we're going to skip the processing in your workbook this time, although you could do that for challenge. Okay, why are we skipping it? Because we're going to do a class project that connects to the processing and do processing in a different way by using last year's student project at the end of the year. Remember the Silk Road's been up there all year. Now it's our time to connect to last year's students. So let's get her done. Let's make a, a great connection, not just a good connection, okay? So we're doing the ISN, we're reading this book, and then we're gonna do a project. That's it, okay? Thanks for your hard work on lesson 23. I know I was pushing you. And I appreciate it. I always wanted to see where you would fall when you had two major projects with Lentz and Stearns. You passed with flying colors. Nice job. Okay, well, that's basically it for the Silk Road. Let's get on it. Let's jump start for success. Mr. Stearns out.